Hello guys, welcome to the Flying Automation channel. We are learning Excel Automation here. So in this series, today we will learn execute macro activity in UiPath. So before uh, uh, executing macro activity, so firstly we, uh, we, we need to know how to create macro in Excel. So firstly we see uh, how to create mac macro in Excel. Then we go to the UiPath and use, use that how to execute macro, macro activity in a UiPath. So let's go to the Excel and see how to create macro here. So you can see I have taken some data here. So, so here I wanted to uh, I wanted to create a ma macro for uh, get the maximum number or minimum number. So in the age column, I want to get maximum age like a 50 and the minimum age like a 22. So I want to get that details using the macro. So how to create macro? So firstly, uh, using the macro, you need to uh, keep things some uh, in the mind. So firstly, uh, go to the uh, see the settings firstly. So go to the uh, file and see, click on the option, and then go to the trust center and trust center setting, and then you need to go to the macro setting and firstly enable the macro, enable VBA macros, this and click on OK. If you uh, already have the like other other in the other option, so click on this, select this option and click on OK. So I have already done. So this setting is uh, necessary. So now I am creating the macro. So you can see here in the home, uh, this is the home panel and this is the view panel. In the view panel, you go here, you, you can see here uh, view macros and uh, record macro. So firstly, I view macro. So I have already created a macro. So I am deleting this macro here. Uh, delete this yes and you can see here now there is no master uh, there, there is no macro so now we need to create a macro so firstly uh, click here record macro and write the name here so writing min max min min max Calculate. So I'm using uh, taking this now and click on OK. So your uh, recording is uh, started. So now, so here only uh, I'm taking click on this cell and taking the value uh, like writing here minimum age. Minimum age here equal to min function. And where you want uh, searching the so select the all the column here range and press the close the bracket and press enter so you get the minimum value of 20 okay so now you get the max edge here click here and write max max and select the range where you want to searching and close the bracket and press enter so you get the both the value okay so now you need to or stop the recording so i have stopped the recording so now our macro is created so i'm deleting this value here and saving this file okay now you can see here in the view macro one macro is created okay when i'm running this macro result is printing here so run this macro you can see the value is coming okay so Delete this again, and here we need to change the value. Like minimum value is nine year, nine year, and the max value is eight year. Okay, so now I have changed in the uh, data file. So now go to the UI path, and using UI path, how can use the, the uh, execute macro activity? So we can see that. So go to the UI path. Here you need to create a one flow uh, workflow. So control press control N and here write macro. Okay, so I'm creating the macro here. So now uh, we are working on the Excel automation. So firstly we'll take Excel application scope activity, then select the file. Uh, here this is a uh, mean max macro data so 
I want to uh, one thing I want to also tell you. Uh, you are saving that file macro file. The, if you are saving this macro file, so extension always be like XLM, not a XLX. So this is important. So select this in uh, extension. So I have done that. So I'm using this file now. I'm taking the activity execute execute macro activity. So now here you can use the macro name here write the macro name here so i'm writing here writing here mean the double quote mean max okay so now done the and you if you want to create the Output is not required because we are uh, output is showing in the Excel sheet, so it's not required. If you want to uh, uh, taking the uh, value from the macro, then you can provide the output. So we are currently we are not taking the value any uh, uh, value. So I'm running the now I'm running this program and show you the output. Firstly, I will show you the in the Excel sheet. Uh, there is no data. Now I'm going to the UI path and run this file. So Processing is done. Now go to the Excel. You can see the I have changed in the uh, age column. So minimum age is nine and the maximum age is eighty. So I hope you understand. Uh, I hope you understand the uh, both things. How to create macro in Excel and how to use macro in a UI path macro activity. So if you have any query, please write your query in the comment section. We will provide the solution. So thanks for watching this video. We will meet in the next video. <laughs>